Two, one, Almost every shape and form in America, we need to look out for enemies, foreign and domestic. Second, there is going to be a witch hunt, I believe, in this country and quite possibly all around the world for two groups. First group, Jews. It happens every time. Second group, I think, conservatives. We oh, yeah. Are it's headed. only going to get worse because under pressure, people should resort to their standards and principles, but they don't have any standards and principles today. Standards have been knocked down by our universities who tell us that truth is relative, there is no morality, it's all your culture or my culture. Well, this Von Brunn's culture is a tribe of racist, anti-Jewish, uh, anti-Negro, anti-immigrant, everything. And therefore, he's a phenomenon of the left because racism is a form of collectivism. The right wing is individualist, believes in individual rights, freedom, the dignity of each individual life. But it's the left wing. You know, Hitler was national socialism, right? How, how did, Harry, it's how a did leftist it, phenomenon. How did it happen that this was, that you look at people who are Nazis and you say that those are right wing? It, it doesn't make any sense Well, there whatsoever. was a deal made between the communists and the Nazis in Germany in the 30s where they each agreed to define themselves as the opposite of the other. You see the percentage in that. You define my gang or your gang and you rule out of court any other possibility, such as freedom without any right. gang rule. So it, it's actually a strategy adopted in Germany in the Weimar Republic in the 30s. We're... we're, we're America, we are, we are surrounded by people who want to control you. We have a guy in office right now, uh, President Obama, and before everybody else, because nobody else is, I don't think anybody else is going to bring this up today. Oh, dare anyone on the media actually say this. We have a guy in the um, White House right now who, if you're going to link people to this guy, who have nothing to do with this shooting, let, let's talk about the relationship uh, with Barack Obama and Reverend Jeremiah Wright, 